it time to retire? Are you thinking of retiring in Washington State? I want to give you the pros and cons of retiring in Washington State, in my opinion. First off, I think you have to figure out what is most important when you retire. I have many friends that are reaching this age and taxes and finances seem to be the most important. But there are many other pieces to retirement that I would assume are just as important, if not more. Is being close to family and friends important? For some, family is their life. Others don't see their family very often. If being close to your family gives you a higher quality of life, then you should figure out how to make it work. What about your friendships? Good, strong friendships are hard to find. If you move away from your friends, are you going to find those same friendships again? People plan their whole life to retire so they can hang out with their friends and their family, but if you move out of state, it is likely you will not see those friends or family often. What activities do you like to do? Washington has so many free things to do. Hiking, biking, walking trails, fishing, there's senior centers with tons of activities, libraries, parks, hunting, exercising. If you like what you're hearing so far, go hit the subscribe button and the little bell for notifications. That way you'll be notified of all my upcoming videos. There are activities that cost some money too. There's movies, golf, fishing, skiing, snowmobiling, camping, dancing, and different clubs around. So if it's activities, we don't have a shortfall of them. The weather is mild. If you do not like the heat, there are not many places with as mild of weather as Washington. Sure, we get the rain, but we're not frozen for months and we're not in scorching heat for months. And it is beautiful here. When I go on vacation, I have so much fun and it's so beautiful to see a different area. But when I come back home, I'm always in awe of the beauty of Washington. Every season brings a different color. It is very important to be able to live comfortably. Washington is not the highest taxes, but it is not the lowest taxes either. But it is one of seven states that does not have a personal state income tax. However, our sales taxes are quite high at 10%, but we don't have tax on groceries. Our property taxes are in line with the average throughout the nation. There are two programs in the state that have property tax relief for seniors. There's a property tax exemption program where you can get your property taxes reduced if you make below a threshold income. There's also a property tax deferral program if you make below the state income threshold. Kiplinger says the best tax-friendly states to live in are Delaware, Hawaii, District of Columbia, Wyoming, and Nevada. There are many senior facilities in Auburn, Washington and Renton, Washington. Whether it be over 55 communities, low income senior apartments, independent senior living or assisted living. If you currently own a home here, the bonuses are homes appreciate well. We have seen very high appreciation in the past several years. If you stay in your house until it's time to downsize, you will have a very nice nest egg to apply to senior housing or to downsize to a smaller home and not have a payment. There also is a program called a reverse mortgage, which allows homeowners to use the equity from their home to pay their mortgage payments. You will want to do your research on this to make sure it's a good option for you. There are quite a few active retirement housing communities in the area. If you would like a list of those, please send me a message or fill out the form below. I'd be happy to send those to you. Do you still want to work part-time during retirement for something to do? We have lots of jobs and lots of part-time jobs. Maybe you want to volunteer. There are lots of opportunities for volunteering as well. So see, Washington is a great place to retire. It has most of the activities you will want to do during retirement. There is something for every season. I hope you really hone down on what is most important to you. Money is not everything. Quality of life is super important. And these are supposed to be the golden years. If you have any questions at all, please be sure to put a comment below or send me a private message. I'd be happy to answer any questions you have. Thank you so much for watching.